Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for all the Pisces Sun Moon and Rising I want to say to each and every one thank you thank you for all the wonderful support that you have been giving me thank you so much I'm sending you I'm hoping for you guys that your wishes and dreams will come true whatever you are working towards this year because you guys have been so so wonderful to um, my supporting my site and supporting myself and I want to say thank you very much for your help your kind words um, and I wish and hope that the next time I can do an online segment and do something for you Pisces because you guys have been such a wonderful support and I want to say thank you so much okay um the month of um, September is going to be a blessing in the skies. The month of September is going to be a blessing in the skies. And why is that a blessing in the skies? Because whatever is happening to you guys in this month, you are going to see um, blessings are going to come to you in this month, which you weren't expecting. Okay, so whatever that has been going on in your life it's going to be a really wonderful um, um, a really wonderful experience that is coming in your life expect and you're going to see um, new positive energies coming up this is going to be um, wonderful because life is going to change as if by magic life is going to change as if by magic so it's um, unexpected luck <laughs> um, yeah this is this is going to be extremely good because whatever it is it's going to be um, help um, um, extra help is you know coming in for you guys so a lot of extra help will be coming in to you guys so whatever you need to help in um, it will be coming and it's going to be it, it's going to be wonderful um, extra help um, is coming in this is going to be positive okay as I look, you have the number nine as your energy vibration. Nine is as if it's the ending of a situation, the ending of a relationship, the ending of situations in your life. I really don't see relationship what I see. So you have the number eight and the number nine and number 11 so 8 9 and 11 is going to be your energy vibration because the energy vibration of uh, this month has a powerful there is so many powerful this is one of the most powerful readings i am seeing so far for this month the number nine energies are so prominent in this and you only have nine it's uh, and 99 is the end of a situation and three times nine is the end you need to move on so it's a month where you need to move on um, for you guys you have the energy vibration of the eight of cups the general energy of this month it is uh, the general energy of this month is a month of uh, um of um, the, the the wheel of fortune is a month where all that was unjust and, and and unjust and that sort of a thing is coming to an end so positive situations are coming in your life but with having and receiving the eight of cups it is time to move on letting go of a hopeless situation this is dissatisfaction situation and going on a new journey the signs of overdue changes and realization so sometimes I can understand that some people keep on holding on to certain things uh, and it is just time to move on let go of a, a hopeless situation okay because you have a, no reason um, to stay in a situation you need to move on so it is time um, for you guys to move on and let go okay move on and let go help will be coming in but you need to move on and let go
of a situation okay extra help will come in okay so um, sometimes it's hard to hear this because Pisces they like to be you know just in one form one stage but sometimes it is best okay all right um as we look at your month um, as I said the energy vibration of the month is the wheel of fortune and um, the zodiac energy begins the month uh, of the harder and it ends the month with the, the fire sign so this is what is happening for you guys in this month okay so this month has four weeks and these four weeks are very prominent you have the energy vibration of the nine of swords which is cruelty a nine of swords which is cruelty and this is how you begin the month the the first week of September as you feel as if you are being um, nailed to the cross for whatever reason it is which you are not aware of and you don't understand okay and you have the two of ones so what is happening here whatever you felt that was cruelty that was unjust to you that has happening okay because is this person that is there and people have the sword and the hands up against them and around them and you felt as if you're unjustly um, accused and unjustly thing there you have the energy of the two of ones so whatever this situation is there's going to be coming an end to the situation and a new part way is going to be opening up for you in a lot of ways so a lot of people who have felt as if injustice has happened to you and you have felt as if you were nailed to the cross you are going to realize because that's how you come out of the month of August into September you're going to realize that new doors and opportunities new portals new doors new um, situations are going to come in your life so that you can change it but in to do that you have to go the distance so whatever the situation is uh, you um, you can't sit and wait because if you sit and wait it's not going to happen you have to really go the distance for whatever it is that you need in your life or whatever it is that you want to manifest in your life you have to really get up and go the distance to get the situation so whatever you have been working forward for in your life if you stand up and go the distance for it it will happen okay that is what it is saying because this month is a month of leaving things that is not working for you anymore and you came in the month feeling as if cruelty something um, you know was bad happened to you and the angels and guides are opening up a new door of opportunities for you a new door of portal so you can walk through that the second week is going to be a very wonderful promising week whatever the situation is that you have with the uh, Prince of Pentacles there is going to be justice so if you have a, a situation a lawsuit with someone who has the energy vibration of, of, of a Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius you are going to win this this um, this lawsuit in this case whatever the situation was that you have with a, a Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius you're going to win this um, lawsuit fair and square you are going to win this lawsuit fair and square so congratulations to you water sign people who have a lawsuit and this is with the Aries the Leo and the Sagittarius you're going to win this lawsuit big in a big way okay and by winning there is going to be an exchange of gifts so that means um, whoever whatever injustice that has been played you are going to win fair and square and you are going to receive an exchange of gift what you will give out so will you receive and <laughs> whatever is has been going on this was an injustice situation whoever this Aries Leo or Sagittarius person that has done you this injustice it was really injustice and this is dishonest what this person has done but you are going to win you are going to be justified and win this lawsuit and it is going to bring you 
positive positive gifts gifts invitation will be coming at you and whatever this lawsuit is always like people are going to start helping you people are, if it's if it's a lawsuit where you win a lot of money and that sort of a thing so whatever whatever happened with this um, situation with someone who is a Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius whatever the situation is you are going to you are going to win and over and triumph over this person if it's not the lawsuit it was a conflict or this person was lying over you and this the 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 the, the, the secrets everything came up the dishonesty that he was playing okay as we move on to the third week you have the nine of ones, another energy of the nine of ones. You are being protected, even you see. Uh, and I, you know, these I <laughs> the first time I found these cards said to be so strange, but now, um, it's 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 positive. It's I'm seeing the positive side of it because obviously you can see that the nine of ones, certain aspect and certain situation has been going on, and this person is being protected, and um, you know, he's being meshed off the mesh are there but yet still he has a weapon in his hand so he's very protected okay he has a weapon in his hand and he's very protected so this is a good 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 expression of uh, what uh, um the nine of ones is so you are being protected and you have the first time the star came out and it's for you Pisces no one else has received the star this is a new card deck I've been um, using this card deck and no one else has received the star and you um, Pisces have received the star and this is wonderful so in the third week it's going to be a very very positive positive situation in the third week uh, we also have the energy vibration of observation whatever the situation is we have the energy vibration of observation so this is wonderful this is positive whatever that was going on this is going to be an extremely wonderful month coming up because you're well you're you know you're standing up you were crucified at the cross and the first week you oh, in the end of August and you're coming out in the first week and it's it's getting better because you are going to distance to change so you can change the situation because you have a the energy of walking away the energies are there to leave a negative situation behind congratulations you are the first one to receive the star card in this deck and it's very positive whatever is going on in the third week observe be still and observe whatever is going on around you just be still and observe whatever is going on around you as we move forward the fourth week is a week of learning another eight and you have the eight of cups and the eight of pentacles okay this is the energy vibration for this month of September eight of cups moving away and you have the eight of Pentacles in the last four weeks the eight of Pentacles is a learning so what this is saying to you is that whatever you have been going through the wheel of fortune is coming to take you to a better place and it is saying to you move away from what this situation um, whatever situation that has an effect in your life for a very long time they're saying move because wheel of fortune is going to move you away from that situation and that situation has to do with someone who is and is a man so this can affect the men if you were in business with an Aries and Leo or a Sagittarius this situation you need to move away and walk away from the situation if you had a lawsuit with this person you are going to win big time because this person was disgusting okay he was working on such a low energy vibration it's a nasty person this is someone that has invaded your personal space okay so ladies and gentlemen walk away whatever it was a karmatic lesson it was something that you needed to learn it was something that came out of another lifetime in this lifetime the energy of the moon comes up and this is wonderful for you Pisces when the energy of the moon comes up because this is the energy of uh, um, 
um, the water energies uh, that is helping you to see a situation and learn something from this situation it's awakening you and connecting you to your individual spirituality right? and that is you are working with the energy of the unseen so your guides and angels are, are teaching you things and letting you see things and teaching you new things and by doing this you're going to be opening up to wonderful wonderful positive situation in your life so be aware um, be open um, understand where you are and by doing that what is going to happen is that you're going to get help a leg up you are going to receive help so whatever you are seeking to do and seeking to understand and wherever you want to go in your life whatever distance you need to take however hard that journey is to accomplish whatever you would like to achieve in your life you are going to receive help from the universe and as you see this bear and this little cub is trying to get up and he's pushing and sometimes a wind is just gonna blow and blow him over there and he's going to reach on the back help is coming in for you um, Pisces whatever the situation is help you're going to be receiving a big push a big positive push in the good direction in your life and this is wonderful I'm so grateful whenever things like this happen because each and every one of us need a little helping and at some time in our lives each and every one of us needs a little helping hand at some time in our lives so whatever is happening in this month is going to be positive it's going to be you moving away from a situation you leaving a situation behind that no longer serve you this situation has to do with someone who is of a fire sign energy and this is the energy vibration of uh, the Aries and it's a man it's an, it, it has to do with a man or a masculine so it could be an organization because organizations or, uh, or masculine energies okay so it could be a situation with an organization which is masculine energy or it's the energy vibration of a man somebody in power or somebody who thinks they have power okay and whatever the situation is you won um, big time against this person whoever this person was the, this person was working on a positive energy vibration and you have won it is going to be a month of unexpected realization over a lot of stuff okay it's as if uh, uh, information is going to be coming at you not really but it's like your angels and spirit guides are going to be opening up in the second week is a positive week is the best best week second week and the first week also but you have to work on in the first week it's as if you need to go that distance you feel as if cruelty there's something that happened and it's cruelty but no you need to just get up go the distance for whatever it is that you need and the last week the second week is a huge victorious success over this person um, this Aries of uh, um, Aries is Harris or is Sagittarius this man and then you are going to be um, in the last week lessons the lesson is going to come out what was the lesson and I'm asking the angels and guide what is the energy vibration of the love love people oh love is going to be fantastic people love is going to be fantastic okay opposition love is going to be fantastic glorious glory some people are going to have wonderful relationship everything is going well the six of ones energy is here where everything is going well but we have an opposition and we want to know what is that opposition who is that opposition the hermit he wants you to look within okay so this is good this is good Ooh, reward the ace of Pentacles okay so this is good good news is coming in in the form of love and there is going to be a glorious victorious um, success in love is so it's as if a love triumphed over all everything whatever that has has happened in your life as an effect over your your love your, your love relationship and 
a triumph the love uh, despite what was going on in your life your relationship it makes it stronger and grow door through the time there was difficulty um, that was happening in your life this becomes so positive so wonderful so there is a victorious triumphant in the form of love for the people who were going through a hard time and yet still you stuck through it all you have victoriously come and there's a glory and the universe is going to protect your relationship because you both had triumphant and had gone through so many so many hardship and there are times that it felt like giving up but you never give up and you hold on and by holding on you have seen a wonderful positive the glory of your relationship so this is for people who have been married for a very long time or ship cape in you could not have done it without your partner because whoever that prince of uh, um, the prince of uh, ones was he has put you all he has put you your family and a situation in your life uh, in, in, in a, a horrible sense that you and your family and people around you it is as if this person uh, and you had to work out a situation from out a former lifetime and he has put you through so much so much and lied and everything and finally justice finally um, people saw the, the that he was being dishonest and unjust and you have victoriously overcome this with your partner and this is good congratulations 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 for this overwinning in the life in love because it's not easy it is not easy especially when you're in a, um, and and this is for people who are in soulmate and twin flame relationship whatever difficulty there was whatever you had to learn whatever that has come up for you you have uh, overcome this okay and you some people feel the feel up um, oppression opposition some people feel like opposition some people are closing off their hearts in this month of September towards love and they feel opposition you are in a dark place in your life and you need to release yourself you need to release yourself and the hermit is here to release you from out of that dark place you have closed your heart off to everything and everyone and the universal angels and the guides and the angels of love and the angels and and the angels Archangel Shemuel and the hermit is coming in to help you to heal the skull upon the Palladians to come in and heal your heart because you some of you are in a very dark place you need to release and bring in the light call upon the angels of love and the angels of guide to come and cleanse you as the hermit comes and take over and open up and bring in the love in your life and the light in your heart again okay Okay. sometimes things happen to us and we need to forgive people that's all I can say honestly honestly um, it's yeah I know what that is like so um, to end your love relationship it is I am a vibrational beam vibrational um, emanating desires okay so okay let's see you live in a vibration in the universe that is managed by the law of attraction the law of attraction is bringing vibrational that are alike together and so it is important for you to acknowledge that uh, you are vibrate uh, you are a vibrational beam constantly emanating in um, vibrational signal of desire and when from your human form you offer a vibration of what you want because you know what you don't want so you know what you do want you ca you cannot contemplate any subject without equal contemplation of wants and unwanted appearing 
vibrational in your experience so this is wonderful this is why I use the vibrational card at the end of the month because it's very important for certain things and certain situations to come out what other messages do the ascendance masters have for you Pisces mother Mary Mary Magdalene and mother Mary is I so love them oh my god okay it's the number eight energy see number eight comes back so um, remember what your your energy vibration was eight nine and eleven and Mary Magdalene is here and Mary Magdalene was um, Mary Magdalene was an I um, innate in the order of the ascent and the spiritual partner of Jesus yes Mary Magdalene was the spiritual part of Jesus even though it was never said in the Bible that Jesus had a wife Mary Magdalene was the wife of Jesus and this is it their information that we got and information that we didn't get okay um, Obviously, in the picture of uh, Jesus with the 12 disciples, Mary Magdalene was also a disciple, but she was not placed in the picture because she was a woman. And this is why, at this time, the energy vibration of the femininity, um, the ascension, is where the energy of the femininity is coming back because they took, they distinctly took out the um, picture of Mary Magdalene because she was a woman. And um, this is going. This was taken out, and that's why ascension now is coming back, where the feminine energies are coming in very strong and very powerful because we're changing the energy vibration of this hurt. So, here that was a little lesson. She is now the master of the seventh ray, and this is what I say to people all the time: If you don't believe in the saints, the gods, and the angels, and the ascendance masters, and all the deities and the goddesses and um, the goddess, you need to understand that they're the rays. They're the rays. They're the sixth rays, the color rays, the sixth ray, the fifth ray, and that sort of a thing. So again, Mother Mary. Um, uh, Mother Mary's Ascension Retreat is in um, um, uh, Marseille, that is in, in um, France, and um, she radiates a glowing um, buttercup yellow light to all who attune to her. Her light was hidden from us, and that's why I say to you again, she was one of the disciples. There were 13 disciples. She was one of them. She was taken out of the pictures, and Jesus of the 12 disciples, this Bible picture, look, there is a space between Jesus and the rest because Mary Magdalene. So, again, she really radiates a, a gloomy, beautiful butterfly, but the, this light was hidden from us, uh, from the center, as she was the misjudged about her role in Jesus' life. See, a lot of people, I don't know what it is, but people like to misjudge other people. You know, people like, uh, and, and, and trust me, people, a lot of people have misjudged me. And this is what I know that people like to misjudge other people. You can't judge other people when you don't know this story and you don't know what, who they are and the rest of it. And yet still you're going to make up, info, make, make up stories about people. That's misjudging people. You don't know who is someone because you have never spoken to them. Okay. Whenever you have a conversation with someone, um, then and there can some people but you need not judge people because whenever you judge people you're just judging yourself because number one if you're going to judge someone that means you have a problem you know that sort of a thing so anyway um, let's go forward if you have felt wrongly or misunderstood mother Ma uh, Mary Magdalene offers you the courage to maintain your integrity and this is it um, ladies and gentlemen it is good to say one simply prior before you go to bed and that is uh, I am asking source creator to give me a clean answer and a pure heart and pure integrity okay pure integrity so whatever you do in the day it doesn't really matter who it is what it is you're going to be filled with 
pure integrity that whatever you do you do it out of integrity so you have no mis um, uh, misjudgment or whatever and even when you see people are misjudging you and you see people you stand above that because you realize that they're still not on their part where they're supposed to be they are still working from out of the third dimensional field okay and this has helped me in my life uh, and 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 uh, it is not easy um, but you will you will master it all um, I maintain my truth and speak the spirituality and seek the spirituality in all things and that's me I let everybody know I'm a spiritual person and I let people know where I stand okay so I maintain my truth and see the spirituality in all things and this is what I live by people this is what I live by I don't judge people I don't um, I don't judge people you know um, circumstances make people who they are and sometimes you're misunderstood is it that you're misunderstood or people just want to listen and understand what they hear okay or is it that people just want to place you in uh, um, where they want to place you and sometimes it's not misunderstanding sometimes people do it like that because they their heart is not clean enough to be honest enough to do the right thing okay so this is powerful whatever I have gone you Pisces whatever is going on with you guys uh, this is such a powerful read and I saw it I know it was powerful okay let's see who you the Sun moon and rising Pisces who are you going to be working with um, Wow Wow oh man as love is in the air oh 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 you Pisces okay it's gonna be a powerful month for you Pisces a wonderful month it's it's a month of healing for you Pisces okay the weather Sun moon and rising sign Pisces you are going to work with these three um, you are going to work with the planet of Venus and I told you love it was a victorious overwinning especially for the soulmates and the twin flame people the soulmates and twin flame people this is powerful it was a a, 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 um, a positive um, place to be it's a victory you have overcome all the negative energies so this is for the trailing seal and the twin flame people um, this is positive the planet of Venus comes in and it's going to work with you and the Aries to heal whatever the negative situation whatever negative situation that has been happening it is coming in to heal you and uh, the Aries people for whatever negative situation that is occurring and has been occurring the negative energies that has been occurring in the Aries lives okay we're moving forward and we're looking at the moon sign what came in for the moon sign people and for the moon sign people we have the energy vibration of the Gemini's the Aquarians and the Scorpions and this is this is this is wonderful because the energy of the Gemini's and the Aquarians or the the the, the hair energy and what it what what is happening is that they are coming in and they're seen and they're master in certain situation and certain effect so the Scorpions are coming up to help you to awaken that side of you which is uh, the psychic side the moon side because the scorpions is governed they're the energy of the moon and um, this is good so this is a wonderful wonderful experience that is going to happen so most of your you moon people um, Pisces moon um, rising people you're going to be touched by the Gemini's the Aquarians and the scorpion and I want to say to you Scar um, your Pisces is going to be a wonderful month. I'm wishing you a lot of love and success. I'm sending you pure love and light. And I want to say namaste. Please like, share these videos. Thumbs up and namaste until next month.